hello everyone this is arohi and welcome to my channel so guys in my today's video i'll show you how to perform image classification using yolo v5 so guys till now we have used yolo v5 for only object detection tasks right but now we can use yolo v5 for image classification object detection and instance segmentation so uh, in my today's tutorial i will focus on image classification and in my next in my upcoming video i'll show you how to perform instance segmentation using yolo v5 all right so image uh, classification is a task where we provide only a single label to the entire image okay so now yolo v5 they they used yolo v5 what they have done is they changed the last layer of the yolo v5 architecture and instead of having a uh, multiple bounding boxes and their corresponding labels they are using they modified their last layer okay and they are uh, classifying over there in the last layer they are showing us the single classification okay so during the time of training when you use yolo v5 as a classifier during the training time the input image is resized and then we feed that input image to a yolo v5 network and then the fully connected layer which is at the you know the last very fast last layer we are using that for the classification task and the loss is how we are computing the loss so the loss function simply means the difference between the predicted label and the ground truth label okay and once the training done for testing the image classification model uh, we are following the same process so we will resize the image first and after that we will fed that image to the yolo v5 network and yolo v5 is working as a feature extractor over there okay and then there is a fully connected layer we will the extracted features will go to that fully connected layer and it will finally tell us the um, the class okay the final classification that that image belongs to which particular class okay so this is how yolo v5 works as a image classification now let's see the practical implementation so this is the yolo v5 uh, repo if you'll scroll down and here you can see first let's see that c for the segmentation and the classification task over here so now i'll show you my tutorial so let me show you the data set okay just a second so i'm working in this folder image classification inside this image classification folder see i have one folder with the name of custom data set in this folder i have my data set let me show you my data set first inside that train and validation folder train folder will have a data which will uh, train your model and on this well folder this is a validation data open the train folder now i am working on two classes keyboard and mouse i'm performing classification for these two objects okay so inside a keyboard folder i have different images of keyboards and here you can see that i have 661 images okay and in the same way inside this mouse folder i have the images of mouse and you can see we have 660 images over here as well okay now let's see the validation folder inside the validation folder again i have two folders okay so guys these folder names are your class names okay and let's suppose if you have 10 different classes okay so you want you have to create 10 different folders and one folder will have the images which is related to one class okay so uh, this is how so in my case i have two classes so that's why inside those folders we have the related images so this is my data set so one and this this folder i have created in this uh, folder i have few images on these images i will perform the testing after training my model okay and this is the yolo v5 repo you have to clone this repo and this is the jupyter notebook i have shared um, the link github link in description section you can get that uh, this uh, uh, jupyter notebook from there now let me open this jupyter notebook and show you how to work so this is the Jupyter Notebook. 
सो गाइज आई एम यू नीड अ पाय टॉर्च ऑब्वियसली बिकॉज दिस इज योलो वी फाइव एंड योलो वी फाइव रंस ऑन पाय टॉर्च सो आई एम यूजिंग टॉर्च वर्जन दिस एंड विद कूडा इलेवन पॉइंट थ्री एंड यू कैन सी ट्रू मीन्स दिस टॉर्च इज कंपेटेबल विद कंपाइल्ड विद कूडा एंड द जी पी यू ऑन विच एम वर्किंग इज दिस इज द जी पी यू एंड देन आई एम क्लोनिंग द गिट हब रेपो योलो वी फाइव ऑफिशियल गिट हब रेपो ओके सो दिस इज द फोल्डर विच यू आर सींग ओवर हेयर आफ्टर क्लोनिंग यू विल गेट दिस फोल्डर ओके सो वंस यू क्लोन द फोल्डर यू नीड टू एंटर इन टू दैट फोल्डर एंड देन यू हैव टू इंस्टॉल द रिक्वायरमेंट्स नाउ आर इन्वायरमेंट इज रेडी टू रन द योलो वी फाइव मॉडल सो ना लेट मी ओपन दिस गिट अब रेपो योलो वी फाइव ना गाइज यू कैन सी दैट वी हैव अ क्लासीफाई फोल्डर एंड वी हैव दिस सेगमेंट फोल्डर सो दिस क्लासीफाई फोल्डर हैव Uh, you know model where the last layer is changed okay for the classification purpose in the same way inside the segment folder we have a instance segmentation uh, code okay let's open this classify folder see train will help you train the model with the help of this predict.py file we will make the predictions and this is for validation okay so now this runs folder will get created when you'll start the training in the same way when we run object detection model this runs folder will get created itself in the same way if you are using this yolo v5 as a classifier this runs folder will um, get created once you start the uh, training your yolo v5 classifier okay and guys now let's see our other files let's go back to the code here and you can see now we are training our model like this okay so python from the classify folder we are using a train.py file okay this classify folder have all the classification files so we want to train the model yolo v5 as a classifier so that's why we are using a train.py from a classify folder and then i this is the pre trained yolo v5 classification model so guys uh, we are not training our model from the scratch we are using a pre trained model and then we are fine tuning it okay so you can get this classification model from here see all these models are here right so this cls means classification model and in the same way if you will open this segmentation so for this segmentation also yolo v5 n seg means segmentation models and we are already aware about these model these are object detection models so now you can get three different kind of models from yolo v5 for object detection these are the pre trained models and for segmentation uh, these model names will end with this seg uh, under hyphen seg and for the classification models model will end with this okay so we are using the classification model and now we have to provide the path of the data okay so our data is in custom data set folder so i'm giving the path of that and epoch i'm running it for five epochs only and the image size i'm using is this okay so once you done the training let's scroll down once your training is done your train model is stored at this location now let's see this location runs train class exp2 here you can see and guys uh inside this weight you can see best weight so we will use the this weight file to test our model okay so now let's go back and let's see how to test our model now python classify folder predict.py file so we are working on a classification application so that's why we are picking the predict.py file from classify and the weights you have to provide the trained weights right so we have trained our model to classify keyboard and mouse so that weight file is present at this location so we are doing that we are providing the image size also now in this source source means on which uh, we, uh, um, this is the path where you want where your images are on which we want to perform the predictions okay so i have a folder with this name okay so on those images um, we want to form um, perform the classification so let me show you that again so these are the images okay 
So once you execute this command, scroll down and the results are stored at this location. Now let's open this location and see what we have. So image classification YOLO v5 runs predict this and let's open all the images one by one. You can see the uh, probability over here 92% this is a keyboard and 8% this is a, a mouse okay in the same way here also you can see 5% is uh, probability is this mouse and 95% is keyboard in the same way you can see the result for all the other images so guys this is how you can run um, use yolo v5 as a classifier Right, so I have shared the link in description section. You can get that um, Jupyter notebook from there and you can try image classification using Yolo V5. So I hope this video is helpful. Thank you for watching.